hey guys welcome to my channel pharmacy international today's video is related to one of the online tools that is required for you people to become a pharmacist in canada that is for pbc as i have made numerous videos related to pbc how to study for pbc and uh, whatsoever books are there to study in order to get yourself more engaged with the study material and apart from that i have made uh, i have cleared my evaluating examination so remote proctoring so i have made those all videos so today i thought i should make a video that is related to one of the online tools which will help you not only during your examinations but also later on when you will be a registered pharmacist over there the name of the tool is rxtx so without wasting any time let's get started to know how the rxtx will work for you so it's cps there are number one drugs and conditions from this particular area you will find out the information related to drugs or any of the diseased conditions next is tools from the tools you will come to know some of the for example like bmi calculator rft renal function tests calculator and all there are umpteen resources and whatsoever the resources are there i will let you know just give me a moment lexi interact from lexi interact you will come to know about the drug interactions or any of the allergy related to any of the drugs here it's a search box it's written that what are you looking for so what are you looking for means you can write any of the uh, drug name con disease conditions name over here and you will get the information about this so let's get started so here is a view or you can see the look of cps you can go to the links from here or you can go to the links from this particular area it's up to you you can find out anything over here so for example lexi interact go to lexi interact from this lexi interact you just have to add the name of the drugs and you will come to know about the interactions see you just have to type the name of the drug over here you can type any name then you have to write any of the allergies and then you have to analyze it that's it and you will get the information over this particular place if there is an interaction or not next is what's new so you can click the option like what's new these are some of the updates you can click on here on any of the updates and you will get to know about the information next is resources there are many resources you can find out any of the thing which you want to know actually the resources are uh, you can say for example uh, let's go to poison control centers this particular centers are there are umpteen centers and you will come to know each centers address or telephone number of every provinces right so this is a way to get the information about poisonous control center like the same way if you want to know about any health canada advisories or anything for example let's uh, go to glossary of medical abbreviations just click over here you can find a list right tools there are these number of tools let's go to renal function calculator from this particular side area you can find out the downloading of the references or formulas for example i'm putting a male over here who is a black by ethnicity let's say age is 65 let's say his weight is for example 70 kg now next is creatinine i'm putting creatinine as 3.5 so these are the calculated results with three different formulas of this particular person who is actually a male black by ethnicity having 65 years of age and he is having weight of 70 kg with creatinine is 3.5 micromole per liter so this is a way you can find out the renal function of that particular person 
again now comes to the drugs or conditions like the same way you can find out what's new over here what's new means recent updates you can find out over here what's new see these are some of the new things which are here you can click on any of the uh, any of these information and you will come to know about everything there are drug monographs if you want to know about monographs you want to know about minor ailments or anything you can just click on that particular thing now come to the area where there is you can write any of the disease conditions for example i am writing hypertension just have to search you will get all the information about hypertension see now as you see that uh, this hypertension is from therapeutic choices that is ctc later on anything related to hypertension can be from minor ailments as well so you will come to know about the minor ailments topics related to hypertension as well so it's up to you whether you want the information from the uh, ctc that therapeutic choices only minor ailments only or all i used to put it like all but if you want to know about therapeutic choices only you can click over here and now you will get the information of hypertension that is in therapeutic choices only see like the same way if you want to know information about any of the monographs you just have to put the name of the drug over here you will find out the monograph of monograph of that particular drug so this is all about uh, the way how you can uh, go to the cps actually and if you want to get the soft copy of that particular uh, for example it's hypertension and if you want to get the pdf of this you just have to click over here a complete chapter will come everything and when you are going to click on this particular chapter there are some table of contents you can go to the chapter like this as well plus if you want to know about only tables then click over here you want to go to this particular table of laboratory testing just click over here you will go to this particular table only like the same way if you want to know algorithm of that particular disease just click over here you will immediately go to the algorithm so this is a way to get the information about a particular disease over here and yes if you want to know the way how to go for the downloading just click over here see there is a option of print just print it here you can uh, save it as a pdf it's the same for the laptop or for the phone you can save it i already have the same so i'm not going to save it so it is a way how you can save it actually so this is all about cps apart from cps there are other resources as well which you can use for your pebc examinations i have make a video for the same you can click on the link that is given in the description actually and from that particular link you will find out the complete resources you can which you can use for your pebc examination